I'm Sir Tap Tap, and welcome back to Black Room. I hope we can serenade you to a beautiful, disturbing night. Sitting in front of the swamp, get out of my swamp! You imagine the sound of 1,000 frogs. Beautiful red mucus drips from the walls. Listen closely. You brush your hair behind your ears and try to listen to the sound of your own breath as it grows in intensity. My own breath is my fetish. Some red mucus here, I guess. Statue of Lady Neptune you recognize from your childhood journals, where you kept detailed notes on the spot and the patterns of many frogs you collected with your sister. Is, is, is Lady Neptune a frog pattern? Or... Hey, I know that Rusalka. That's Rusalka from, um... I knew there would be some Quest for Glory stuff in here. <laughs> they kind of edited it so it looks like she's doing a booty dance. That's another Sierra point and click. It's like a limo underwater. You know, that's nice. Normal, like only slightly rich people have regular limos, but when you've got the underwater limo, that's when you know you've really made it. Are these like weeping Sakura willows? I want one of them. There's like this murder plant here. Look at, is, is that from, um, is that from, um, The Sims 1? It at least looks like The Sims 1's art style, so to speak. There's some Lady Draculars, some Frogos. You gotta have some Frogos. I really wonder how deep this dream goes. I kind of figured it'd be maybe an hour tops, and, uh, I think we're a moderate bit past that. Maybe not a crazy amount. Got some hooks. Got some blood. I just clicked like the brokenness of a window and it broke. Whoa. All right, that's just the blinking. Those are the bees from Zelda. When I clicked that, I kind of expected to be transported to uh, your, you know, that breathless thing. What's this? We got more Rusulkas. Oh, that's just a mermaid. Never mind. Bubbling purple jelly-like organism arises from the water. Hello, friend. Strip fighter HTML? What? Oh no. Wait, was this the thing? That does look like a strip fighter over there. I was not aware of this game. Look at the look at that ballerina thing. There's Puff the Magic Dragon. Uh-oh, we've got some some artistic boobums. It's okay, they're covered. Stood. We've got some key pose. Tasteful. We've got some kind of organ here. That's nice. That's what I like in my Strip Fighter games. Th that is inappropriate. Do not do that. Cover that up. Cover, cover that up. That is... No, no, no. Oh, I can't cover it up. Oh, no. This is... <laughs> I was not aware of this game's existence. Wow. Yuri. We go from Strip Fighter to Yuri.html, but it's fine. It's not that kind of Yuri. It's it's Yuri, not Yuri. You know. Uh oh! Don't don't break your freaking top off over there. I see that. I see what you did there, game devs. Naughty, naughty. Well, well, there's so many frames in that animation. Look at that. That is a well chiseled booty in in the middle of those frames too. Dang. Why are there so many frames in that? That must have been from a later one or something, because that is like a lot. See, even when games are in 60 frames per second, they're like never actually animated to 60 keyframes, because that would be completely absurdly ridiculous. Um, even like 3D games, they're not really 60 keyframes. That would be even 30 keyframes is inordinate. You're usually talking with <laughs> you gotta have the butt slam. I do remember the butt slam from Mary. This is another SNK, right? I, I think I sure me. Yeah, we saw Shermie, didn't we? I've seen this person. Yeah, yeah, the bedroom. Living rooms, bedrooms, done it. You can find it at the market. Oh, hey, it's mine. I know this one. Good old my Sharba Barbus. Look at this head. Look at this beautiful head. It's just like meh. 
Oh, this is like, dang it, my, my body's all the way over there. This is not, this is not how a fancy lady such as myself should be. This is, this is unfortunate. Oh, do not show the butt. There's way too many butts. Oh, there's another butt. It's clothed though, in a sense. <laughs> we've went, we've gone from the boobum zone to the booty zone, to the demonetization zone. Speaking of SNK, I mentioned this like a couple of videos back, so you probably forget by now, but uh, I saw that uh, 40th anniversary thing from that, the Heroines Tag Duel Dream Team, whatever SNK game. It's like a bunch of the female characters from various of their fighting games, like in one, I guess. And that's not what I expected their 40th anniversary sort of game to be, but it probably wasn't like intended as that. I mean, maybe it was. I mean, it's. Crossovers are a pretty sensible way to do it, you know, an anniversary. Yeah, I, I'd be more interested in it if it weren't, you know, fighting game, and I had more attachment to, uh, to SNK. It is interesting. Unearthly and aggressive giant dragonflies buzz loudly, close to your ears. Rude. Blue Mary. Yeah, that's another SNK one. Quiver Bates really loves the good old SNK stuff. We've got an alien egg. Got that same chopper. Got some tank tread. This is, that's just a car. That's just like a jalopy with tank treads. That was not a tank. Bootleg tank. <laughs> got a little taunt pose there. I wish I liked fighting games more than I do. Like I like the idea, but like I just don't have the time to like get particularly good. And like I want to enjoy all of these pixels in their natural state, but I just. I just enjoy watching them once in a while at, you know, Evo or whatever. But uh, Skullgirls is the only one I ever got kind of okay at. I could play a decent uh, Valentine and uh, Sarabella. That was about it. I never really found a third character I was particularly good at. I tried a little bit. Uh, I tried a little bit of everybody, but never really found another one. I was, th like, semi-half barely okay with Philia. Like... As far as, you know, Scrub that has never been any good at a fighting game is, like, okay. Not like, okay, okay. But I had a friend that, a friend that I need to, like, ring up. Not literally, because using phones is for, you know, old people. But uh, <laughs> I haven't talked to him in a while. He's a big FGC head and uh, programmer, too. Need to bug him a bit. Isn't it weird how... I kind of lost track of him because of just the, my uses of technology kind of changed and I didn't use the site that I m met him from and I don't think he used that much either and uh, they used to hang out on like a Facebook chat thing it's like I never use Facebook I don't like Facebook I blech uh but yeah I, I found some of them on Discord but they're never <laughs> really there on Discord so it's like what, how, how do I talk to these people uh, it sucks because like the internet kind of at least in terms of chat programs, the internet kind of diverged and got it got harder to talk to your friends because everybody has like some people using line chat and some people using you know whatever dumb crap. But it seems like most people that are into gaming are on Discord, so things seem to be settling out because Skype sucks and we're all leaving Skype. Anyway, bit of a tangent. The room is red. It brings to your mind your mother's favorite nail polish. You'd often borrow this polish and paint it onto the trees to help lead you back to your home. Your mother would get upset, but never yell at you for wasting the polish. Read the label. You read the label on the bottle of polish. Can't make out what the text says. Ugh. This, why are there so many ASCII boobums in this game? We got Jennifer again. Yeah, we, we found, I consider myself to have beaten this. So. It's neat, but... It's not quite Yumi Nikki. Dust. Uh, that's the. Wait, her name wasn't Dust. Was it? That's, this is the. No, that's Blaze. That's Blaze. I know that that character. I guess it's named for the other, like, Dusty stuff. Oh. <laughs> Look at the um, reverse. That's, like, supposed to be a dragon thing, but it's just kind of mirrored. To make it look like a big old worm thinger. Is it just me or these things getting, like, louder? And, like, starting to clip together? There's those walkie tea thingies. You ever had a hamburger take a bite out of you? 
shadow. Oh, same music. Mr. Frogman, the bottom left there. This is some other character that I do not know. We got a burning thing. Those Japanese buildy thingies. <laughs> Look at that natural leg motion there. Natural. <laughs> Speaking of natural, that's the most natural thing I've ever seen. Look at him go. Huh. No idea what any of this stuff is from. I like that little Grim Reaper sprite though. That's enough of that one. Oh, more? Okay, just back to Shermie. Alright. Two nude women stroking and beating heart. That's somebody's fetish. Somebody out there has a fetish for attractive women ripping out their own heart and like the women gently touch their, their removed heart. And that, that that is what gets them off moments before they die. Go! Okay, I went. What what is this? What is this music? It doesn't help that this one is still going. Wait. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, I can't mute individual sight like things. That's annoying actually. Can I I can't do the Oh whatever. It's just more of this. Yeah, that's loud. Dust. Okay, we saw dust. Did we see this thing? Oh, we didn't. I would mark many trees with my initials and the initials of a lover that only existed in my dreams. A different lover for every tree. Wow. Dream me really gets around. Is this the Zelda, like, fairy fountain theme slowed down? I'm just noticing this. I think that's what it is. Oh, we found the thing. Harpy.html. Yellow. Furnace of gold in the corner. The humid air. You notice streaks of red nail polish on the wall. Lift your arms. You stand between the doorway and press the back of your hands against the sides of the frame. Holding that pose for 30 seconds before you move out. Your arms appear to float up. Okay, whoa, yellow. Very yellow. Very yellow. Is that... What is that? It's like a centipede with wings? Above a winged salamander basks in the pure yellow light. It sure is pure yellow light. Oh, Chun-Li! I know that one. <laughs> I, know, I know that one. I see, oh, and I see uh, Sim Earth thingers. It's silent. Why is this one silent? Oh, there, that's the egg chair from Sims. I knew, I knew there was some Sim stuff. And there's the windows. So this is like Sim Simish. That's that's from this little walking dude, or I think that's from uh, the Aladdin uh, Genesis game. It's so quiet. Why is it so quiet? It's way more unsettling now that it's quiet. I didn't. Did I leave it muted? Oh, it's not muted. It's just like this. Huh. We got that heart wreath again. Piles of mud with dozens of eyes. Consider the gift of sight. <laughs> Search. Search.html. That's interesting. There's a there's a dog pissing. Of course, that's what a good. There's lots of poisons doing like what I can only assume are like extreme calisthenics here. Like you ever done push-ups? Like handstand push-ups? I don't think I don't think that's even a thing. Oh, I'd search because of the little thingers that are searching around. I see. Got some broken thingers. All right. I, th I thought maybe with search there would be like a thing I'd be looking for and go someplace. Selena. Well, we got. Oh, we we saw this one. I think there's the Felix. Felix the cat. All right. Did we go to this friend? Chun Li, yeah, we went to that friend. A golden safe with several knobs quietly whispers something valuable. That's what safes are for, right? Oh, look at that! Look at the faces on that hand. What is that friend from? There's a lot of good friends in this game. A lot of good, like SNES era friends. 
I guess I assume Catherine is this woman that has exactly one animation. Everyone else has like a lot of animations. Seriously, why is it so quiet? It's freaking me out, man. I can hear the walls, man. I can hear them closing in. Let's go through a door. Triss, yes, we seem to be running low on the uh, things. There's a lot of Triss is taking naps up here at the top. It's so, like, uh, five more minutes, mommy. All right, what's, do we go to this? No description, huh? There was an urgency in the woods. Each step I took felt more intense than the last. I was alone, but not lonely. I had all of my imaginary boyfriends with me. Oh, now there's music. A dark creature agitatedly hops, its armless body repelled by bird-like legs. Is it trying to tell you something? Okay, it's trying to tell me inappropriate things. I don't like that. Alright, well, I see the thing. So what? what is it, though? Ugh, no, what, what, what is it? Oh, it's, it's just a flower. Okay. Bloop. Alright, that's dark room for black room for today. We will keep digging through the wastes tomorrow, I suppose.